Hi guys, it's Nicole and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is my junior year glow up where I go from this to this. But before we get into it, here's a word from today's sponsor. Thank you so much to Case 5 for sponsoring this video. Case 5 cases have the best protection. Their latest protection technology, EcoShock, is embedded in their iPhone 14 Impact Series to protect your phone in your daily life and beyond. It has optimized case protection, providing protection up to 11.5 feet, and their cases are five times the military standard, meaning that it's been drop tested 130 times to ensure that EcoShock doesn't wear off. Case 5 cases are slim and sleek. With EcoShock, they manage to achieve optimal protection while maintaining the sleekness of the cases. So no more brick-like phone cases and you can easily slide your phone into your back pocket. Case by Cases offer a huge selection of prints and customizations, so you'll definitely find one that you'll love. There are a bunch of artist collaborations and also accessories like MagSafe wallets and power banks. And last but not least, their iPhone 14 cases are made from 65% recycled and plain face material. They're also partially made from upcycled phone cases as part of their Recaseify program. Now here are some of my favorite Case by Cases. This first one is the one that's currently on my phone. It's a pink impact case and it has the cutest graphic ever it says i'm busy go away this is one of their mirror cases and i customized it to say nicole this light purple one is one of their compostable cases and as you can see there's extra bumpers for more protection and then lastly this is one of their pillow cases and i customized it to say coley and this pink and yellow heart all right guys you know the drill it's drop test time so here's my case before there's no scratches cracks everything's in great shape i'm gonna drop it in three two one moment of truth it survived! Whether you're upgrading your iPhone or not, head to casebuy.com for their latest iPhone 14 Impact Case Series, as well as their cases for iPhone 13 or earlier devices. Go to casebuy.com slash today to get 15% off your order. Alright, now back into the video. Currently on the way to the nail salon. These are my nails right now. Last time I got them done was before Hawaii, so it's been long overdue. They're so grown out, and then look, this one like fell off today at school. I don't have like a design or like an inspo pig, but I'm definitely gonna cut them. Like they're so long, and then I might just get white because I don't know. Unless I find like a color that's super cute, but I'm pulling in to the lot right now. They just feel so much healthier and like a lot better and like i don't know if this is anyone else but like after getting my nails done and having a fresh set i just feel so much more put together but i ended up getting white on my hands and my toes i figured to just get like a simple color i also haven't gotten white in a while and then also homecoming is next month and i plan on getting like a fun bold color for that but now i'm gonna pick up an acai bowl i just put in a phone order can i have a small tropical blend with strawberries okay great thank you so much okay <laughs> this angle is not flattering whatsoever then i got my bowl Mm -mm -mm. This is me telling you go treat yourself go get your favorite food. Trust me. It'll make you happy I haven't had a bowl in like a few weeks I feel like I film every time I get a bowl So it just like seems like I get it all the time, but I don't know. Okay. Anyways, I'm gonna go home now Peace out. Good morning guys. Today. I'm getting my hair done. So currently this is what my hair looks like right now It's actually grown a pretty good amount and then my curling bangs are pretty long too But today at the salon i'm getting my hair cut and also coloring my hair Basically, i've been so indecisive of what to do with my hair for the longest time now I was like should I cut it again? Should I color it again? So today we're doing both I'm definitely asking for a trim because the ends of my hair are pretty dead It's like mm, not cute at all And then I might cut my curling bangs just a little bit because they're kind of long and then lastly i'm asking for it brown highlights so these are the two pictures that i sent my hairdresser so hopefully my hairdresser pulls through i'm gonna be in the salon for like three four hours i think today but my appointment is at 10 30 so let's go mom is taking me to the salon good morning and we just picked up einstein bagels or einstein bro bagels because since i'll be in the salon for so long like i'm definitely gonna get hungry so i got a garden avocado sandwich wait are you gonna like tell the dresser what i want or yeah, I'm just gonna I... make sure she knows what you want and okay. then be like, well, how much is it gonna cost? Like, think about mm, it. Um, okay. Okay, because I was like not sure if I am saying what I want. No, just. Because I'm very used to my mom like doing all of that.
Here, I'll put a picture on the screen of what the back looks like so you can see the color more. But I end up going with like a lighter color as you can see. I think this is called a honey blonde balayage. Originally I asked for highlights, but my hairdresser was like, no one really gets highlights anymore. It's like mostly balayage. So yeah, this is my new hair. And then she curled it. I'm so happy with it. I don't even know what I was expecting, but I think it's fun. Hello guys, it's the next day. I just finished school, but I'm honestly so tired. Like I just want to take a nap. But no, next thing we're going to do is go to the gym. Basically, I haven't been to the gym in literally literally forever like i don't know why but i've just been like unmotivated and like haven't wanted to go so i haven't but today we're changing that and i want to get back into a routine of like going almost every single day so i'm gonna change out of my school clothes and put on a gym outfit here is my gym fit i'm planning on taking this jacket off but it's from princess polly it's like an oversized gray one and then underneath i have a lululemon cloud bra and then also lululemon shorts but i'm getting more excited i feel like the hardest part about like doing something is getting yourself to actually do it if that makes sense because like when i'm at the gym everything's fine like i'm having fun working out but then i think the process of like putting on a gym outfit driving to the gym i don't know it like seems dreadful but finally doing it today and i feel great plus when i work out i feel healthy after and that's like a very big part of taking care of yourself so so definitely wanted to add this in the video okay anyway see you guys at the gym i just got here i'm about to park i plan on doing 12 to 30 on the treadmill and then maybe going upstairs to the women's only gym and doing abs and butt maybe we'll see <laughs> <laughs> I finished healthy 30 I felt good and I'm too lazy to go all the way back to my car and get my water so I'm just gonna drink out of the water fountains here but I'm walking up to the women's only gym and I'm just gonna do some small abs and small butt workouts I ain't living to pay no bills but I pay these bills so I can live now ain't that a shit Oh my gosh. Okay, not gonna lie, my legs are like low key shaking. Well, also, biggest mistake is not bringing water or forgetting your water in the car. Never do that when you go to the gym. I was so thirsty. Okay, but now before I go home, I'm actually gonna make a quick stop to Coffee Bean and get some mango cold brew, which I also haven't gotten in a really long time. But for some reason, I'm craving it right now. So we're gonna drive there and get one. Cuff It by Beyonce, such a good song. Okay, anyways, I got my drink. It's so good. If you watch my videos from like this past year, like maybe middle of sophomore year, I became obsessed with this drink, the Mango Cold Brew from Coffee Bean. I literally had it almost every single day. Like before school, I would go to Coffee Bean, pick it up and drink a large in like one period. I was obsessed, like literally obsessed. But then I think around like summertime, yeah, towards when school was ending, I low key got sick of it. Cause since I got it so much, like, I don't know, I kind of fell out of it. So I haven't had it for a few months, but it's still very yummy. I think they taste they might have changed the formula too like i feel like it's sweeter than before but still really good if you guys have a coffee bean next year and you haven't tried this drink try it trust me right when you get it you're gonna be obsessed coffee bean please sponsor me okay anyways time to go home welcome to my bathroom oh my goodness there we go next is taking a shower and doing some pampering this is literally just like a part of my night routine but i think this is self-care that i can add into this glow video hold on there's a plane so I'm gonna explain all the products that I'm gonna use in the shower. First we have Olaplex shampoo and conditioner. On my other social medias, I've posted like pictures of my new hair. So then I'm getting some comments that are like, make sure to use purple shampoo or are you using purple shampoo, blah, 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 blah. Purple shampoo, by the way, is to like maintain your hair color. And especially if you don't wanna go lighter, like it won't fade as much. But no, I am not using purple shampoo. I feel like I should be, but I'm just sticking with Olaplex because their products have been working like really well for me. So after that, I wash my body with the Method Body Body Wash. This is the coconut one. It's really good and then i also plan on shaving so i'm going to use my tree hot products i have the exfoliator and then the shave oil and they're both in the scent coconut lime and then last thing i just wash my face with the cetaphil gentle skin cleanser and that's my shower okay see you guys after shower is done body is pampered i feel great i cannot wait to lay in my bed tonight if you know you know like after you shave and you lay in bed literally best feeling ever but the products i used after i got out of the shower for my hair i used the olaplex bonding oil and olaplex bond smoother then for my body i used the sol de janeiro brazilian bum bum cream and then skincare i just used the sun bum moisturizer next we're going to be productive i always feel my best when i'm getting all my stuff done completing my to-do list basically thriving when i'm productive so the things that i have to do tonight are 
homework, editing, and then packing, which I will explain. But let me get my planner. I have a good amount of homework to do tonight. So far, junior year hasn't been like kicking my butt. Here's my homework for tonight. I have to read either one or two chapters in my AP link book. Study for math. I have a pre-calc test tomorrow. I have an assignment for history and then take notes for AP environmental science. So it'll take me probably like two hours. I usually work at my desk and then sometimes I move to my bed if I like don't have to write anything. So let's do it. these new blankets and they're so freaking cozy anyways i finished all my homework and now it is time to pack okay so you must be wondering like what are you packing for where are you going during junior year so i actually leave tomorrow but my mom and i are going to palm springs to attend this youtube event it's a very quick trip we leave tuesday night we're there all day wednesday and then we already leave either wednesday night or thursday morning but i need to pack all my clothes bathroom stuff electronics and i need to do it right now so let me get all my stuff together and then i'll show you guys everything that i'm bringing all right guys here's everything that i'm bringing to palm springs so I'll just explain everything. We have my clothes over here This is the bag that I'm gonna try to fit everything into then here are my electronics and then bathroom stuff Okay, so for clothes I have my PJs just a random t-shirt and then my Olaf pants and then I have three different dress options They're all from princess Polly. Oh, wait, actually this is a romper Um, and then I think these two are dresses I have this tank top also from princess Polly and then these shorts from Nordstrom I have this jean jacket from Meshki, which I'm gonna put over my dresses and then this hoodie from princess Polly looks like this Okay, and then last few clothing items. I just have a workout outfit, Lulu tank, Lulu shorts, and then bathroom stuff with all of my makeup and skincare. And then for electronics, I'm bringing my laptop, editing equipment, and then this camera, which is the Canon M50. I'm going to try to fit all of this in that bag. I mean, I'm pretty sure it'll fit. There's like only less than 10 items. I know it looks like really overpacked, but for the most part, everything fit. I think I'll just put this with my mom's bag and then I'll be holding those things. I am done packing. That took me like literally less than 20 minutes. It's great. All right, you guys, this wraps up my junior glow up. I hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me. I changed things to my parents. We were healthy at the gym and also productive getting stuff done. So far, junior year has been treating me pretty well. I'm not gonna lie. I've been very happy lately. So I'm hoping that continues on for the rest of the year. And I also hope that you guys are having a good school year and also taking care of yourself and making sure that your mental health is in good shape just want to say with this glow up video like obviously doing things to your parents doesn't matter i just think doing things that make you happy and taking care of yourself is the biggest glow up you can do but that is the end of this video so i ended up filming a little bit of my palm springs trip so i just decided to add the footage in this video enjoy hello guys hello. so we made it to palm springs today is tuesday september 20th we left right after school mom drove three hours have a good nap <laughs> yeah it was nice but basically i'm here for youtube creator summit so this is an event where they bring a bunch of creators to just like help them with their channel like provide them with resources to support it's gonna be really fun and i'm excited we're currently checking in right now i just had to do a covid test Thank you. good to go <laughs> and we're waiting for the results so we're just in this waiting area sitting here and then after that we'll check into the hotel Just got to a hotel room. It's so cute. I love this oh hotel. What is going on? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Mom's so on the verge cute. of crying. <laughs> okay, let's do a little room tour. What is this? What is that? <gasps> oh my goodness! Okay, wait, hold on. Let me just show you. Here's what it looks like when you walk in. We have this table. And look, YouTube bandana that says Creator Summit. And then a water bottle with my name on it. This like mist thing because we're in Palm Springs and it's hot. Oh, a sticker. This is so cute. Look, you got a bandana too, mom. Oh, yay. Okay, so we have that. And then the two beds. And then here's this towel. Welcoming me here to the Creator Summit. It's so cute. Oh, wait, is it a robe? Yeah. This is a robe. Our goal for this week is to provide the space for you to recharge, to spend quality time together while learning and sharing about topics that matter to you the most. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. I know, I feel like I'm gonna like tear up. <laughs> <laughs> like... Okay, and then here's the bathroom. I love it. Dude, how exciting. So what are we doing? So there's a welcome event. Let's get ready, get changed, and let's mingle. All right, you heard it there. <laughs> 
here are the fits. We're just gonna walk downstairs. I think there's like music playing or something. So it's we're just gonna album. go towards. Yeah. reception literally so fun there are just so many creators here and honestly i'm feeling so inspired like the energy down there is crazy like there's not many young people or like people around my age so like i'm just so grateful to be here like i'm seeing youtubers that i've literally grown up with it's just crazy and then matt was here i saw him and the Merrill twins and a few other people but i'm just so grateful to be here like thank you so much youtube for inviting me i would have never thought when i started vlogging that i would be invited to a youtube event so which is a very surreal moment and i love it here i'm super excited for tomorrow apparently there's like a bunch of activities to attend and it's just supposed to be like relaxing and like helpful for our channel, I guess. But mom and I are gonna order some late night room service. You guys, there's $300 caviar. <laughs> okay, but I'm gonna shower while we wait for the food. Time to eat. We got salmon, bolognese pasta, and then steak. I'm just gonna eat and then knock out. See you guys tomorrow morning. Good morning, guys. Oh, good morning. It's super early. 7.43 in the morning. We're gonna do Pilates. <laughs> so downstairs, I think like in a grass area, they either have Pilates or like a hit workout. And you can either choose one. I don't know yet. We're gonna see. Wearing a work outfit. And yeah, and then after that, we have breakfast. Like right after. <laughs> 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 Just finished the workout. Mom, how'd you do? Oh, I feel really strong. <laughs> she didn't even do half of it. It was really fun though. Yeah. Like, I feel great. Sydney, do you want to say hi to the vlog? Hello. This is Sydney. She just hey, led the workout. Thank you so they much. They crushed it. She crushed it. <laughs> Time for breakfast. Our reward. Oh my goodness. Oh, there's waffles. Mini Belgian waffles. Guys, this place is so cute. Look at the setting. Here's my breakfast. Priscilla, do you want to say hi to the vlog? Sure. Guys, this is Priscilla. She works at YouTube. Hi. She's my YouTube manager. She's my YouTube manager. <laughs> Like like Alright guys, we freshened up, went back to our room, and this is what I'm wearing, but now we're going to the main lobby. They told us to bring the bandanas they gave us and comfortable shoes, so I don't really know what's going on, but we'll see. But all the craters should be there. Pretty, pretty yeah. day. I know, it's so nice outside. It's been a little bit since I last filmed, but basically, <laughs> that thing in the main lobby, it was just like a panel with like YouTube executives, so and then just like all the creators in the room, like we got to ask questions, and they just told us like so much information, like I learned so so much. I don't know how I'm here. Inspired. Like now. it's just amazing. Like, yeah. Okay, but we also did a scavenger hunt. We got split up into like teams just with different creators and it was so fun. The reason I didn't film was because we weren't allowed to in the room. So no one was really filming at all. And I don't know if I can film like the breakout sessions that are happening later, but I just wanted to update you guys. We also ate lunch. Very yummy. Okay. But I'm getting bug bites. Oh my gosh. We have like an hour break before the breakout session start, so we're just gonna rest. <laughs> hey guys, breakout session number dose. <laughs> so the first one, we just came from like the spa area and we were talking about creative burnout, like how to not burn out. Basically, she was telling us you need to take care of yourself before things go bad. Um, but now this one is about how to build your team. <laughs> and my team is right there. <laughs> just the two of us, so hopefully I'll learn some stuff. But I'm in this egg, it's very comfy. I'm I'm afraid I'm gonna fall asleep. We're in the main lobby. So then there's just like creators gathering so that we could talk about these different topics. Yeah. Do you want me to film you? Sure. Oh, we that. Oh, yeah. Walking back to the room once again. After the breakout sessions, we had something in the main ballroom. Also learned a lot. There was this one guy, he talked about so much. I just was mind blown about what he was saying. Oh, and then look, we won. <laughs> we got YouTube medals. So that scavenger hunt thing that we did earlier. <laughs> <laughs> Our team name so was We Miss Susan the most, and Susan's the CEO of YouTube. So then the judges, they liked our team name, so we won. We stood out. We stood out. That's right. And now I'm gonna treasure this medal for my whole life. But basically, for the rest of the night, it's just party. So there's a pool party for three hours, and then like like a night club. I don't even know. But I'm gonna change this to my bathing suit right now, and then we're going to the pool party. Guys, 
This is Pete. Hi. We've been hanging out this whole weekend. He's yes. my new best friend. This new is, BFF. No, that's Mama Leno's best oh, friend. Oh, sorry. No. He's my mom. This is well, my best friend. I thought friend. they were sisters. Yeah. And he was also on my team this morning, and we won. Yes. So he got a medal, too. Took the medal. <laughs> the medal. What's up? Dude, we were reminiscing. Real ones, though, boss cheer. Oh. <laughs> Second party. I have a hot dog. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I want food. I think there's like really awful. I don't know. Okay guys, back in the hotel finally after such a long day. It's 106 a.m. <laughs> but just to wrap up today, like overall, literally so such a good day. Like, oh my goodness. I can't even express like how crazy it is to be here. I know I've said it like a lot already, but just being around all these creators, like I don't know how I'm here. But I got to meet so many people. I learned so much and I'm just so honored and like blessed to be here but i'm gonna go to bed and we actually have a spa appointment at like seven in the morning which i'm very excited for because i'm gonna get a massage and i've never gotten a massage before i'm gonna get some good sleep and i'll see you guys tomorrow Oh, it gosh. is way too early. It's 6 56 a.m. Our appointment's at 7. 50 minute massage. It better be good. I'm definitely gonna fall asleep on the chair. I'm so excited. Couples massage. Love you. Love you too. This is how we're gonna be for the next hour. <laughs> See you after. Massage <laughs> is done. Pretty solid, you guys. Pretty that was solid. my first massage. I had a great experience. Oh my god, it's great. It was a full body massage. So literally, she covered everything. My back, my chest, my arms, my legs, my feet, my scalp. Like literally. Did she do her butt? Yeah. <laughs> It was great. <laughs> I liked it a lot. <laughs> I liked it a lot. Okay, but we're gonna f try to find breakfast now. Here's my breakfast. I also have a smoothie. But we're just taking it back to the room and eating there because we are so tired. One last thing of Crater Summit. There's one last panel in the main ballroom. Alright guys, we're going home. Just want to say thank you so much to YouTube for inviting me to the summit. Like, I've said this so many times already, but like I just couldn't believe I was there. Surrounded by all those creators. I don't know. Inspiring. So inspiring. But that is going to be the end of this video. Hope you guys enjoyed this little pop trains vlog and then also my junior year glow up. These past few days have been so nice. This glow up for junior year. Obviously I changed things to my appearance, but we're also productive and I'm feeling so motivated and inspired now after I went to the creator summit. So I'm just feeling great and I hope that junior year goes well and I hope that you guys are also having a good school year. Thanks again to Kiss Bye for sponsoring this video. Make sure to click the link down below or go to kissbye.com slash Nicolino for 15% off. If you stay till the end of this video, comment down below the palm tree. <laughs> and yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to like, comment down below, subscribe to my channel, turn on post notifications, and go cop some Coley Self Care merch. I will see you guys back with another video. I love you guys so much. Stay positive. Bye. Thank you.